countries continue to discuss how to implement the ambitious climate treaty signed in Paris. But the next global check-in will happen next November in Morocco, a country that is leading the charge on renewable energy. Located at the edge of the Sahara Desert, about 260 kilometers from Marrakesh, it's the starting phase of the world's largest solar plant. The $2 billion project called NOR1 uses half a million parabolic mirrors to focus sunlight to heat liquid that's then used to create steam to power turbines. And it's just gone live. With an output of about 160 megawatts, NOR1 is the first of three phases under a plan to create a massive solar complex supplying 580 megawatts of solar capacity. That would be the biggest in the world when completed in 2018, about the size of the country's capital city. With the Moroccan king flipping the switch just recently, 650,000 local people will now use solar electricity from dawn until three hours after sunset, already saving hundreds of thousands of tons of carbon emissions per year. It's part of Morocco's ambition to generate 42% of its power from wind and solar energy by 2020. And by 2030, the desert complex will provide electricity for more than 1 million people, 52% of its energy. The entire project will cost about $9 billion, with funding coming from climate investment funds, German and European investment banks, as well as the World Bank. Morocco hopes to use the next UN Climate Change Conference as a springboard for more renewable energy ideas. Although 600 million people across Africa lack access to reliable electricity, the continent is becoming a testing ground for cutting-edge solar power, mostly in the form of small systems that supply lighting and some electricity to individual households. And now, your Science Smart. If you have a science question on your mind, send me a tweet and I'll try to get it answered.